Good morning. I'm trying not to blind you with the sun that's behind me. Well, I only have a tiny little smidge of snow left in my yard. Not even really enough to call anything. It's on the north side of my cedar tree. Oh boy. One of my cedar trees got broken down by the ice. Oh well. Needed to trim this back a little bit anyway, so now I'm going to have to. Whew. It's a beautiful morning. Kind of chilly. The weather station said it was 32 when I left for my run this morning. That seemed to be about right. But it's not raining or snowing, so that's a good thing. <clears throat> Although today I guess it's supposed to be really, really dry. And after the last three days of lots of sun, we have a fire watch in effect for the area. But it's all good. Beautiful day. Morning motivation. Monday after Easter. We didn't really go all in on the candy and stuff this year, although we did make some chocolate brownies. <laughs> Those are pretty good. But I only had one. I only had one. And it wasn't very big. And I had it with some yogurt, so that made it healthy, right? Anyway, <clears throat> by now, some people who made New Year's resolutions have already given up. Well, don't give up. It's April. Uh, in my part of the world, it's starting to warm up. We still might get another snowstorm or two before the end of April because we often do. I won't say always because we don't always, but we often get another snowstorm or so in April and May. Well, not so much in May, but it's not unusual in the mountains to get some snow in May. Um, but weather's warming up. It's easier to get outside. And if you're not into the garage workout like I was, like I did all winter, and I continue to do, um, then, you know, it's a little more difficult. But uh, I see a lot more people out walking. Don't see very many people out, out running, but the, other than the ones that I already saw during the winter. The runners are either a little bit crazier or more dedicated. <clears throat> Myself, I, uh, <laughs> if it involves a treadmill, I'm usually not going to do it. Although when I was working at the gym at the high school, I did use the treadmill a few days because it was icy. Because I would come in to work early um, when I was working at the gym at the high school before this whole COVID mess. I'd come in early, run a mile or two, then open up the gym and uh, and do my calisthenics workout while the, I was supervising the gym. And uh, some mornings it was just too icy for that. So I would go in and use the treadmill. I didn't really like it a whole lot. Whew. Beautiful morning though. So don't be discouraged by your setbacks because everybody has them. I've had some setbacks over the last couple weeks. Lost my focus, haven't been hitting my pull-ups and dips as hard as I was and uh, so now I got to get back into that routine make sure that's a part of my workout so just keep after it that's the only thing you can do really um, being healthy a lot of it's up here in your mind you got to decide make you got to make decisions and, and you got to have make some sacrifices because it doesn't come without it. Because if you're giving up time for something, that means that's time that you could be using for something else. So if you give up some time for your health, in the end, you'll be glad you did. But at the time, it might seem kind of inconvenient. Anyway, I hope everybody has a great day and a great week. I'm on spring break from school. Well, sort of spring break from my work at school, but <laughs> I have a paper due on Sunday for my college course. So. My spring break will be taken up with some research and writing. 
And uh, anyway, everybody take care. Have a good day. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.